So if you watched the previous video, you probably know, and it's very obvious, that I took these two videos back to back before I left to America. But I wanted to make sure that I get a video out to you guys while I'm away. So if you're watching this, it most likely means that I'm at the moment in America. I would like to share with you something I found at uh, the convenience store, 7-Eleven to be exact. Actually, correction, at Lawson convenience store. And this actually won the Good Design Award. Yes, there is such a thing. And I think um, it's the design of the ice cream, not the packaging. But uh, this is what it looks like. This is an ice cream. It's a wagashi type of ice cream. And there is mochi, there is anko, which is sweet nazuki beans. There's a milk ice cream and a monaka, which is sort of like an ice cream cone, but in a different shape. Um, when people ask me what is monaka, it's really hard because it, it, it's kind of like an ice cream cone or, or a wafer, but a really, really flimsy, very delicate wafer. I really don't know how else to describe it, but it tastes just like an ice cream cone. So this is 150 yen, it's an average price, not cheap, not expensive, not bad, and it really, really comes down to the taste. If it tastes awesome, it is definitely going to be worth 150 yen, but if it's not that great, I don't know, it's up to you. Tear ourselves a piece here, so it's kind of like a pie, Just we just break ourselves a wedge here, height, and that's what it looks like. Okay, and that's what it looks like. Um, that's the milk ice cream. You do see the azuki in here. The like your mom's. Hmm. 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 That's really nice. The ice cream is very white. It's not yellow like vanilla because it's not vanilla. It's milk. That is the mochi right there. That is the uncle, the ice cream and the monaka casing. The mochi is very nice. It's chewy. It's on the firm side, which is totally fine. All the flavors go so well together. Milk, azuki, mochi, and monaka. Makes sense. It makes a lot of sense. I think this would pair really well with some matcha or simple green tea. Diet Coke, not so much. You know, I do eat a lot of ice cream and I have been eating a lot of ice cream this year. Um, especially since this summer was so hot. I, I literally could not survive without either eating ice cream or kakigori or something. Really, really cold. So now I'm kind of in the habit of eating ice cream every day, which isn't a good thing. Um, so I really gotta get out of the habit. I've been noticing that there are a lot of Japanese type of ice cream, like this one for example. This one is called Yawa Mochi ice cream, but there are a lot of, um, of course, green tea ice cream. There's a lot of um, ice creams with uh, azuki beans inside, mochi. Uh, there's a lot of, we have a lot of mochi ice cream. Oh, I just saw this new one. It was a cookies and cream mochi ice cream, and I've never seen that before, so that's kind of interesting. So right now, I am imagining that I'm having a wonderful time in America because once again, if you're watching this, as soon as it's released, it means that I'm in America at the moment. I'm, I'm um, imagining myself in Los Angeles. What am I doing right now? Most likely, I am eating some, most likely, I would probably be eating, eating, <laughs> an amazing ice cream sandwich. That's what I'd be eating. That's what I would be eating right this moment in Los Angeles. Oh yeah. <laughs> anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for taking the time out to watch this silly random video. I've been making these random videos on this channel. Um, sometimes I don't know why I make them. Uh, most of the time it's because I wanna share something with you guys. I find something at the store and I think, ah, I wanna share this with you guys, so I do. And then while I'm making the video, I think how stupid it is. But I don't know, please let me know what you think about these random videos. Um, I promise I will talk a little bit more about serious things um, because I do have a lot of things, a lot of um, 
stories to share with you guys. Um, that was the purpose of this channel. Not the only purpose, you know, I, I, I want to um, show you more lighthearted things as well. And you know, food of course, because you guys know how much I love to eat, as well as travel. But I do want to keep it a little bit different. Um, meaning that I want to get more personal with you guys. So um, when I come back from Los Angeles, I'll probably make a video that's a little bit more personal. And hope you guys don't mind. Anyway, have a great day. Um, and hope to see you guys when I get back from Los Angeles. Bye-bye.